Hello there all of you positive people, it's me Grindin here, welcome back to our Wizard 101 Balance walkthrough. Last time, we got into this River of Frozen Tears, and now this time we're heading into the Celestrat, Shrine, which I can't believe we made it this far already. It's insane. Um, but this dungeon here, it's pretty tough. The stone chamber so... appears to be ancient, but it's been immaculately maintained. The air still feels clean and fresh. Jehur Hardin, children of the New Age. In your tongue, I am called Vigilant Parent, and I extend to you the welcome of the Sunless Shrine. From the dawn of this age to this time of twilight, my fellow Lufalim and I have maintained our vigil here. The Auroracle foresaw your coming many centuries ago, and all this time we have waited to administer the trials. To gain audience with the Auroracle, the first trial you must face is the trial of courage in the north wing of the shrine. Okay. Terror hounds. Why did it have to be terror hounds? Okay, these guys should be easy, I think. Maybe. I don't know. It's been like a while since I've been Polaris. <laughs> I say that too much. I'm sorry. Wait, who's this? Who's this? Oh yeah, these guys have a bunch of health. I need to research this. <laughs> These terror hounds don't cheat in any way possible because they're not bosses, they don't cheat at all. So hold on. Yeah, they don't cheat. Okay, but. One of the hardest bosses here is in here. I think. Who knows? Okay, so. Yeah, it's. Tajniak and Joniak. Joniak is the liar. What? Well, I don't think they'd be the hardest ones. I don't think. It should be easy if you defeat the actual if you defeat the correct one first. Whoa. 
was only the first of the trials? Great. Can't wait to see what's coming next. Why is this stuff always so difficult? Yay! I don't want to do this anymore. I mean, I kind of have to see progress. Jehoiakoraj, young one. You have completed the trial of courage. To gain audience with the Auroracle, you must prove you are as wise as you are brave. You must face the trial of wisdom in the South Wing. You will meet two brothers. One of them will always bear false witness. One of the other will always bear. speak the truth. One of the brothers has poisoned claws. He must be struck down first in the duel. Pay close attention to what is said. And look, I'm going to tell it to you straight. My brother, that's not true. I'll tell you this much. If you ask him, he tell you that I'm the one with poisoned claws. So these guys are pretty much breaking the fourth wall here. We got we got to kill We got to kill the death boss first. Johnny Ack. Of course, Tarnish would not be tolerated. Obviously, be a death blade right there. Wait, did I give him? No, he's like lying.
little while to figure it out. You're pretty sharp, you know that? All right, so two trials down, one to go. I think we can actually do this. Jehovah's, young sage. You have proven you are as wise as you are brave. For your final trial, you must prove your skill at arms and face the trial of valor. Vigilant Jerillo awaits you in the sanctuary. He will test your mettle. The Aurora Call has foreseen that you will visit her, but only when you are worthy. It may be that you will have to return another time. Even if I wished to, I could not go easy on you. It is my sacred duty to ensure you are prepared for what is to come. Okay, so I don't think this boss cheats. I don't think so. I checked on the wiki, it doesn't say anything about him cheating. I'll check again just to make sure. Okay, all I know- uh, okay, there's no cheese, but- but there's something about his natural attack dealing like an unknown quantity of damage. Who knows?
400 health left. What? What? Suddenly drop. No. Okay. Okay, he's gonna cast that Raging Bull thing again. I don't know why, he's like, he's got low health. Not gonna judge. You have faced many battles before today, and they have honed you into a champion among the children of this era. Return to Vigilant Perrin, and he shall usher you into the Auroracle's presence. Okay. <sighs> Jehoa Valur, young chap. You have faced Vigilant Jarillo in a duel, and proven you are as valiant as you are wise. You have proven your worthiness to gain audience with the Auroracle. I shall presently usher you in to see her. Before you enter, however, you must know that she is fragile. We do not know what has befallen her, but she appears to have taken ill. Perhaps it is simply time. She has awaited your coming since the dawn of this age, an age now in its twilight. You may enter the Auroracle's chamber. Hear her counsel, but do not expect to fully comprehend it. That often takes time. Here we go. Now that is something you don't see every day. I read the ancient text, but I never imagined she'd be so beautiful. Not all things are definite, but we always knew the moment would arrive, and so it has. We watched as the first world was destroyed and wept. Then the song was sung and the spiral was woven. We forestalled our sorrow. But that which was frozen in time and in our hearts flows again. The first sign is nigh. A shadow comes to tear land and sky asunder. After, it soon is only a matter of time. When the sand settles, the spiral shall end as it began, with a broken heart. Hearken to me, though. Should the moment rise, the sundering shall be stopped, and the hastening shall be slowed. That was interesting. I didn't really understand it, but it sounded pretty important, don't you think? You should go back to the witch's house and tell her what the Auroracle said. Maybe she can make something of it. I'll catch up with you. I have some questions for the Auroracle myself. 
I'm hoping she'll be a little more clear with me. Yeah, do we still have time to continue this episode? Yeah, we still have a little bit more time. So what this means is... The spiral was created with the known broken. The first world was destroyed uh, by something. Probably Old Cop's heart, which is broken. Probably not, uh, probably not, um, a hundred percent clear with this, but, but the song, they're talking about the song of creation, which wove the spiral together, and then Morganth was trying to sing the song again to reverse it and destroy the spiral, and now we got Grandfather Spider, who... Uh, is going to end the spiral with a broken heart so he can see the first world once more. But this is also confusing to the grandfather spider arc because because if he uses his broken heart, he'll destroy the spiral. Uh, he'll destroy this he'll destroy the spiral. But if we destroy grandfather spider uh, spider the uh, then that doesn't change anything. The spiral still ends. So again, still hoping for a like something we can do to do this like in a non-aggressive way. That's what I'm hoping. Like probably put Grandfather Spider back where he belongs, maybe. And maybe when Imperia comes out, we can try to pick. Uh, we can pick. Which side we would belong to. I don't think King Zhao has enough. has the technology to. to put like a side picking plugin to the game. I don't know if that's gonna be possible, but I really hope for that to happen when Imperia comes out. It's about time. Ivan's here now, too. He's been waiting with all this coming and going places like a circus. I know. It's kind of fun, isn't it? So many exciting things going on. Have you heard the riddles the Auroracle spoke to the wizard? I'm more interested in hearing why you disobeyed me, girl. But not now. Let the Oski speak. He's been waiting for the wizard to return. Yes. Ivan comes from Irville Station. Very bad there. Rasputin has turned town into prison camp. This is where he takes prisoners from Bastille. Many, many penguins there being forced to work in Rasputin's mine. Ivan needs wizard's help to free them. What do you say, comrade? You should go. They need you. And that'll give us time to research and try to figure out the meaning of the Auroracle's riddles. Perfect. Then Ivan will go ahead. We'll meet you on road near Irville Station. I swear to God, that eye, I swear to God. Don't delay, wizard. I need to have a word with my daughter. And then it sounds like we have some work to do. So yeah, we're heading into Irville Station this time, which should be... I don't know what to say about Orville Station. To me, it sounds like a kind of a game reference to Papers, Please. Mm -hmm. Who knows? Wait a minute, the ship was already referenced. <laughs> Ivan is glad you are here, comrade. Irville Station was cozy village, but Rasputin has built walls and gates, turned it into prison camp. Many years ago, this town, Irville Station, this is where Ivan's career in circus ended after making 
terrible mistake. During show, Ivan dropped barbell. The audience laughed. Ivan went on the rampage. Knocked down tent. Terrified many children. Very bad. After this, they call him Ivan the Terrible. Ivan has lived with shame many years. But perhaps today, he can make amends. There is secret tunnel under wall in the city. Red Rosa has gone ahead to scout. Let us go and join her. Oh yeah, and this is where I should probably get that balance put now. Maybe. Ah, here we are again, mes amis. Joining up to liberate penguins from their cruel oppressor. Perhaps we are becoming experts in this business. All the penguins from the Bastille are here. Rasputin's cooler guards keep them in cages and march them in and out of the mine in shifts. They rounded up villagers too, except the old ones. I have seen an elderly penguin peeking out of that house across the street. I think you should go in and find out what he knows. I will stay here and keep watch on the street. The house smells of musty old clothes and decayed vellum. An elderly penguin watches you expectantly from across the room. Yeah. Hello. You're late! Yes, I knew you'd come. I had foreseen it. I'm Nostradonymus. I see the future. I've even seen the end of the spiral. I can't really talk about that, of course, but that's not why you came, is it? No! You want to change your name, don't you? Wait, no? Really? Oh, yes! You want to free the prisoners! Of course, I knew that. I was just testing you to make sure. Freeing the prisoners, yes. <sighs> Mayor Lassard is who you want. I have foreseen it! I don't know where they're holding him, but he's the key to freeing the village. You'll have to convince the Gulag guards to talk. Drop them up a bit, and they'll tell you where to find the men. Yes, that should work. Okay, this guy's strange, so I'm gonna leave the episode here. Right now, thank you all so much for watching, as, uh, as always. If you did enjoy this episode, why not be a possum person by high five that like button? Never see all of you possum people in the next video.